After much anticipation and debate among fans, Marvel has finally unveiled the fate of Elizabeth Olsen's Wanda Maxima in Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. Towards the climax of the movie, Wanda, also known as the Scarlet Witch, appeared to meet her demise as she brought down the Darkhold Castle atop Mount Wondegore in a desperate attempt to rectify her past actions. However, her actual fate remained a point of contention, as her physical body was not shown amidst the aftermath of the cataclysmic destruction. In a recent official book titled Marvel Studios The Marvel Cinematic Universe, an official timeline, it has been definitively confirmed that Wanda Maximoff perished at the conclusion of Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness when she obliterated the castle on Mount Wondegore. The book narrates the events of the film, stating that Wanda's undoing was brought about by her deep love for her children. The Scarlet Witch is finally stopped by what she loves, her children, who are safe and happy with their own mother, but are terrified of this sinister version of her. Furthermore, the book explains that when Wanda employed her powers to destroy Wondagore, this act marked the conclusion of two significant threats to all of the multiverse. It suggests that one of these threats was the Darkhold Castle, while the other was Wanda herself. As the kindly 838 Wanda gathers the boys and assures the heartbroken Scarlet which they will be loved, the Wanda Maximoff of Universe 616 surrenders. She destroys Wondagore and collapses it upon herself, ending two great threats to all of the multiverse. Notably, this section of the book is designated with the symbol denoting the death of a major character. Previously, Marvel Studios president Kevin Feige had alluded to a mysterious red flash just as the Darkhold Castle fell on Wanda expressing uncertainty about its significance and suggesting that anything is possible in the multiverse. With the recent confirmation in the timeline book, it appears that Wanda did, in fact, meet her end. However, fans had speculated that the enigmatic red flash might have indicated a last-minute self-rescue by Wanda, thereby implying she survived. Now that Wanda's character has been officially declared deceased, it doesn't necessarily preclude her from returning to the MCU in the future. Given the multiverse exploration currently underway, we've witnessed multiple instances of character variants appearing in various projects. Consequently, a variant of Wanda could potentially reappear at a later date if both Kevin Feige and Elizabeth Olsen are inclined to bring her back. In fact, Olsen had previously expressed interest in being part of an MCU X-Men project. In conclusion, Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness is available for streaming on Disney+, Plus, and while Wanda's fate may be sealed in the current timeline, the Marvel Multiverse continues to hold the potential for intriguing developments. Hold me close till I get up 